Hey, what's going on? Welcome to the channel. My name is DRL, and we are here with some NBA 2K Mobile, and we are back with another episode of No Money Spent. This is episode number 28. We have completed the gauntlet grind, and we are claiming our first Plasma Quartz Steam card on this account. And we're also getting a few other cards that are going to make our team even crazier. So we're going to claim this Calm Alone, and we're going to build out the rest of our team, show you what our new progress is, and throw them into some head-to-head -head gameplay. That way you can see the brand new No Money Spent squad. All right, so let's get into it. Claiming this Calm Alone, man, this card is incredible. It is going to be such a beast for my team. And if you see my Worth the Hype video, y'all know that this Calm Alone gets buckets. He's going to fit this squad even better. Here goes the No Money Spent squad. There have been people asking me for my player ID. This is the player ID for the DRO, which is a No Money Spent team. You can see it on the screen. And I'm also going to show you the player ID for my main account, which is right over here. I was using my 100% style bonus team, but definitely follow both if you want to follow along my progress for both accounts. All right, so we're rocking the final 2023 Cosmic Jasper Tony Parker. And this feels pretty good, right? Considering I took about two months off on this account to be able to get two Cosmic Jasper theme cards over the last couple weeks. Plasma Quartz Power Forward. We've been able to build out our squad pretty good. The only thing we need is a new shooting guard and a new small forward. But I'm pretty okay with the choices I'm using. Now, I do have a bunch of keys that I can open up. Let's try to see if I can get some new shoes for Carmen Lone. Let's go to the store and see if we can pull some new epic shoes or maybe even a legendary shoe. These were my latest epic shoes that we pulled from the final 2023 tourney. But they're for the Boston Celtics. And the other two pairs I have are for the Mavericks and the Miami Heat. We got 363 elite gear keys. Pretty confident I can get at least some new epic shoes to use for my players. Let's start that up and then we'll build them out and throw them into my head tight match. All right, so let's see what we shoes we can get with 360 elite gear keys. Come on, come on, come on. Let's get something fire. There we go. We got some Air Jordan 31s. This is for the Milwaukee Bucks, but they bring up layers of dunks plus two. So not a bad shoe. We can get a Giannis in the future. They will work out really well. Come on, what else, what else? Let's go. My first legendary shoe on a no money spent and my first legendary shoe ever from a pull. Every other legendary shoe I got was from ranking on the leaderboard or from a finals or from attorney's rewards. This is crazy. And y'all seen it here first. It is for the Houston Rockets. We got a pair of legendary shoes for Hakeem, the dream, Elijah Wan. Let's get it. Crazy. Let's keep it going, man. We'll get two of them. All right, we got some shoes for the Memphis Grizzlies plus two da dunks. Those would be great for John Morant. Only time right before a new John Morant card comes out. We got some Fear of Gods for the Washington Wizards. Those are plus two to post scoring. Those are real good. Epic gear, though. There we go. We got some shoes for the Miami Heat, plus two to rebounding. Those would be good for Bam Adebayo and Kevin Love. Alonzo Mourning. Got more where that came from. Let's go. We got some shoes for the Charlotte Hornets. Hyper Dunk 2008, plus two to agility. Those would be great for the Mellow Ball. But listen, totally didn't expect a legendary shoe. We got some D-Little Fours for the Milwaukee Bucks, plus two to rebounding. Another shoe that's good for Giannis or the Kareem Abdul-Jabbar. Four more left. Come on. Some D-Little Fours again, but this is for the Golden State Warriors. I can use those with Draymond Green. We do have the triple doubles version of him. Of course, I want to use Carl Malone. We got some shoes for the Cleveland Cavs. Plus two to three-point shot. Not a bad shoe. We'll use that for Donovan Mitchell if we get him. We got some T-Mac Millennials for the point guard position. Those bring up playmaking by two. Right, here goes our last pool. Let's see what we can get. We need something for the Jazz. What we got? Okay. T-Mac Millennials for power forward. We can use that with Carl Malone. All right, so now we have a lot of new shoes to rock. We got to upgrade everybody's build. So for uh, Tony Parker, area of opportunities for him is layups and dunks and defending. So let's see if we can bring that up. So we definitely could bring up defending with the Curry Lows. And that's what I'm going to go for. So this brings up his defense up to a six, which is really good, right? You want a point guard that can steal the ball, create those fast break opportunities, or at least create another opportunity for the team. Richard Hamilton, we got playmaking plus one and three-point shot plus one. I might leave those shoes on. The only alternative will be the Shaq Attack 4s, but I don't really need him to get layups and dunks. So I think I'm okay with that build. Milo Anthony, we got the LeBron 13s. Brings up post scoring to 6 and strength to 6. 
Let's see what other alternatives we got. We got some defensive shoes right here. That's going to bring Amelo's defense up to a five. I like that better. Carl Malone, we got the D Rose eight, which brings up rebound in my two. Rather have a faster Carl Malone. But we'll bring up playmaking up to a six. That mixed with agility will help with his speed. And if for Hakeem the Dream, we're going to rock them legendary shoes. That's so crazy that we got those. This actually is going to max out his rebounding. He had a six in rebounding already, so he didn't need the plus two. But regardless, the other two attributes that we could get from these shoes will help him big time, right? We're going to take a look at the gear list and see what other attributes are unlocked. The Sublight Pros. So for the Sublight Pros, the first stat is always plus two to rebounding. It looks like the last stat is always plus two to strength. So looking at Hakeem Olajuwon, he has a five in strength right now. So that will max out his strength. That's a very good stat to have for your big men. And as far as the second stat, it could be either plus two to shoot off dribble, three point shot or agility. So hopefully I'll get that plus two to agility. So this is a pretty good shoe for Hakeem Olajuwon. Now that we have the players built out, let's take our new no money spent team into head to head. All right, here we go. We're going up against the Phoenix Suns. They got a Hakeem Olajuwon as well. Should be a great matchup. Ray Allen as well. Oh yeah. Let's get it. Got the tip. Mailman got the rock. He's going to give it to Hakeem. Easy flush. Banging on him. Let's get back on defense. Stay on him. Got the strip. Almost. Good defense. A nice little flow today from Jalen Brunson. Knicks Nation. I got to respect it. Here we go. Quick tempo there from Tony Parker. Let's get the screen. Beautiful pick and roll. Right there to Hakeem. Mid-range special. Nope, but Carl Malone is there. Up and under. He got that. Strong put back. Let's keep it going. Steel, we got it. We are pushing. We got the break going. Tony Parker with the crossover. He's going to hit Melo. Melo's going to hit Hakeem. A little spin action. Too big, too small from the mailman. It was not Hakeem the dream, but the mail was delivered. Let's go, baby. No easy baskets. We're getting another steal. Yes. This time, Carl Malone is going. He's going to do his signature dunk. Nah, he's going to stop. I had a feeling, though, because the defense was approaching quickly. But there goes Tony Parker around that pick. He's going for the mid-range. He got it. You know Tony Parker can hit those. Come on. We got the momentum on our side. Let's get it. Steel, let's go, Hakeem, on a fast break. Oh, he is too fast. He is pacing. Easy jam from the big man. Can we get another one? Oh, yes. Do we have enough time? Richard Hamilton, straight flush. Strong first half from the squad. Can we get another fast break? I think it's possible. There we go. We got it. Tony Parker is going. Hit his call Malone. They stopped him this time around. Too many bodies in the paint. Surprised the mailman didn't get that layup in there, though. He's a lot stronger than those two guards, but that's just something that happens in the game. Come on. Beautiful pass right there from Brunson. Oh, we got Richard Hamilton wide open for the catch and shoot. Green light all through the night. Beautiful playmaking from Tony Parker. Couldn't get that deflection is out of bounds. Come on, come on, come on. Can we get one here, though? You almost had a chance to get a bucket. Keem wanted to swap that shot. But good play making. There we go. We got it now. Melo leading the break. Tony Parker's going to take this pull-up three. Green light all through the night. You already know. Team is on fire. There we go. Steal. Oh, man, he got him. 
Carlos Buza was able to get by. We was reaching. Tony Park is going to find Carl Malone. There we go. Spin. Never mind. Baby hook off the glass. Too big, too small. We got another chance to get a bucket. The defense is fierce. Come on. All right, they finally call a foul, man. We was getting a lot of deflections there. Can we get an inbound here? We could definitely use another bucket. Watch him. Who's it to the rim? Strong rebound. We are going. Mellow's trailing. We see Richard Hamilton over there. He's going to pull back. Mid-range J. He misses that one. And I think they called offensive foul. I mean, a uh, loose ball foul. Loose ball foul. We're going to get another opportunity here. Mellow's going to cook. Never mind. Right to the rim. Crosses up the opponent. That's just easy right there for Carmelo Anthony. Can we get another basket? Can we get another steal here? Good put back. We got the rebound. We are going. Tony Parker for three once again. He doesn't nail that one. He had a good look. He definitely did. So there you have it. The brand new no money spent team that we are using. Team is coming along after the taking that two month hiatus for sure. I'm excited to have these NBA legends on my team. As always, I appreciate all the support y'all been showing on the channel. We'll catch everybody on the next episode. Peace out.